Hillside family. My name is Claudia Yang and I am the chair of the Hillside Council. I've been reading Psalm 42 this week. It's a psalm of hope. The psalmist longing to be with God in his temple remembers worshiping with shouts of joy and thanksgiving among the festive throng, not unlike us. We miss being in God's presence together to worship him and encourage one another. With the psalmist, we remind ourselves to put our hope in God who loves us and is with us in these times of waiting. The psalmist writes, put your hope in God for I will yet praise him, my savior and my God. I am so thankful for the ways we can worship together. I appreciate Daniel leading us in songs and hymns of praise. I appreciate Jonathan's sermons of encouragement and gentle challenge. Council met this week by video chat to connect and to pray for our church family. We understand that this time is hard for everyone. God created us to be in community and we long to be together. This time brings hardship of many kinds. We want to care for one another and reach out to meet one another's needs. Please reach out to your Hillside family if there's anything you need. As council members, we want you to know that we are available through email or phone should you need us. We'll send this message out by email also and include all of our email addresses. We are so thankful for our church staff. They've been very proactive in finding ways to stay connected with the congregation and to be supportive and encouraging. We hope you're taking advantage of the worship service from home. We hope you're feeling encouraged and supported by the staying connected video messages from our staff. The staff and some volunteers are calling everyone in the church directory to offer encouragement and to see if there's any needs we might meet and to pray for each family during this time. If you haven't received a phone call, please let us know. We want to stay connected. Please continue to give to Hillside. During this time, we continue to pay our staff, support our ministry partners, and meet the needs of our church family and community. Just a quick example, just before the shelter in place, we took 20 bags of groceries to Park Mead Elementary School for families who need some extra support. I'm so thankful we could touch our community in that way. The psalmist writes, by day the Lord directs his love, at night his song is with me. It helps me to remember that God is always with me. When I wake up in the morning, I say, this is the day the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. When I close my eyes at night, I thank him for his presence through the day and his protection through the night. I have hope that God redeems all things. May God bless you in new ways during this time.